I wish Liverpool extends the contract of their summer signings. I bear no personal issues with Jurgen Klopp. Reflecting on last summer, it's unsurprising that Liverpool looked to the Bundesliga for their 150 Mittenters midfield overhaul. When Jörg Schmatke was appointed as the Reds' sporting director, it was evident they would tap into his German connections. Julian Ward facilitated Alexis McAllister's 35mm arrival before Schmatke utilised his contacts to secure Dominik Soboschlei from RB Leipzig for 60 Milletours and Ryan Gravenberch from Bayern Munich for up to 40 Minetos. Klopp admitted they had to wait patiently for Gravenberch, while the pursuit of a holding midfielder led to Wataru Endo's 16.2 meters signing from VFB Stuttgart, despite initial skepticism. Klopp and Endo both acknowledged that under normal circumstances, Endo wouldn't be a Liverpool target, but his contribution now appears both economical and strategic. While the Hungarian initially performed well, he struggled in the latter part of the season due to two hamstring injuries. Conversely, the Dutch international has shown flashes of brilliance but has found it challenging to secure a regular spot in the starting lineup. As previously mentioned, Endo had a slow start but has since impressed after earning a spot in Klopp's starting Avins midway through the campaign. His performance may have surprised many in England, but not Liverpool legend Didi Hammond. He hasn't surprised me, Hammond told The Echo. When he arrived, big names aren't always necessary. Maybe it was a blessing in disguise not to sign Caicedo for over a hundred million dollars because I knew what a talented player he is. He helped keep a struggling side together. I always thought he would surprise a few people because he's very disciplined, technically gifted, two-footed and a team player. I'm not surprised at all. It might have taken a few weeks or months to adapt to the pace of the Premier League, but no, he hasn't surprised me at all. He's a top quality player. As a former Bayern Munich player, Hammond observed Gravenberch's struggles in Bavaria before his move to Anfield. Despite a mixed start there, he's confident the Dutchman has more to offer and hopes he'll have the chance to prove himself under new manager Arne Slot. Hammond's candid evaluations of Liverpool have previously sparked tensions with Klopp, leading to heated exchanges through the media on multiple occasions. However, the former Reds midfielder emphasises that he harbours no ill will towards the soon-to-be departing Liverpool manager. I've never had any issues with him, he emphasised. I recognise that when I comment on the club or the team, it's never personal. And I understand his defence of the team, the club and himself. It's all part of the job's high-pressure nature. I've never had a problem with him, still don't. And if I do see him, I'll talk with him if he's willing. No hard feelings, all is well.